I'm going to introduce you to a rather remarkable man. He's Mr. Michael Fitzpatrick from Killeney, Manute. Now, he started to draw the old age pension in 1927. And seven years ago, he got the president's bounty on his 100th birthday. Now, he's from County Clare. He came up from Clare in 1940 to a land commission farm in Manute, where he lives now. You have seen a lot of changes, Mr Fitzpatrick, in farming. What would you say was the biggest change? Well, machinery. And what sort of a machine would well, you think that made the biggest impression? Well, <coughs> well, the reaper and binder is a great one, but by God, the one for cutting up the ground and throwing the crop is a powerful one to him. Well, you were, you were saying you're, at, at the time you saw the mowing machine first, it, it made a tremendous impression on you. It did. Because it didn't been, how could it be done at all? What was the the reaction of the people at that time to the mower machine, Mr. Fitzpatrick? A great many of them wasn't minding it and could have forwarded it, but more of them got at it. And some of them, I think you told me, uh, wouldn't have it on the land at all? Well, I had a good father, but I said about our town land, he wouldn't have allowed it in it. He used to pay a mint for cut it at three and six pence a day. Do you, do you remember uh, c uh, cutting the harvest with the reaping hook? Oh, it was, it was all of it. Cut for years and years and years, not years, but it cut it. And how do you think that the reaping hook compares with the combine at the present time? Oh, uh, well, there's an awful difference. <laughs> an awful difference, I see, anyway. Because the combine is just going in one slot of the day, is a poor reaper and bind that wouldn't be no waste. Now, you also remember, I think, a rather historic thing in the land history of this country, the Bowdyke uh, Bo evictions. I do remember. I could, do. You, could you describe for us what happened at those evictions? You were at them. I was at one of them for about five hours. And, and, and what happened? Ah, that was very cruel. That threw out children and women and there was shit. Well, there was one of them thrown out one day I was in it. And the baby was only about three days old. And they were sitting, they were stood on the bank of the they would go for their legs. Oh, it was cruel. And how about the uh, 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 type of food you had to eat at that time, Mr Fitzpatrick? What sort of, what did you live on? Well, we, li we had to live on a long time on an engine man and flour.